After nearly two years of bitter partisanship and campaign rancor, we're finally at Election Day in America. The candidates have held their last rallies, and it really just comes down to the voters now. Heading into this Election Day, we've already seen more than 40 million people cast their votes. But in a lot of important states like Pennsylvania and Michigan, voters really have only one opportunity, and that's now on Election Day. Hillary Clinton goes into this voting with more pathways to the 270 electoral college votes needed to win than Donald Trump. Trump's path is narrow. He has to win big states like Florida, but he also has to turn some of these uh, Democratic states that Hillary Clinton really feels like she has a stronghold in. So look for Florida to be a bellwether tonight. North Carolina, another important state to keep an eye on. What Clinton is banking on is big turnout among minorities and young voters, these same voters that made up President Barack Obama's two winning coalitions. Her campaign feels confident that they've done the work on the ground to ensure that these voters show up. What Trump, of course, is hoping for is that this groundswell of support that he's seen at his rallies will translate into the polls.